All right, guys, what's going on? Welcome in. So we have some Jets news that just came out. Some interesting Jets news about a visit with Jadavian Clowney. Jadavian Clowney has a visit lined up with the New York Jets. Now, on one hand, Jadavian Clowney, it, I, I mean, oh my, nobody's talking about Jadavian Clowney on the open market. He's coming off such an underrated season. Not many people are talking about him outside of like Ravens fans. Nine and a half sacks, you know, you look at Clowney, this is a, well, I mean, he's a seasoned veteran. Ravens, Browns, Titans, Seahawks, Texans, right? He's bounced around. He's played on tons of tons of different teams. He's also had success in numerous systems as well. And the one thing always that always stood out about, uh, you know, about Jadavian Clowney, his athletic ability, just his, his raw power, um, you know, the get off of the ball, right? Just th there's there's something physical about Jadavian Clowney that just gets coaches, gets defensive coaches fired up. Um, and yes, he has missed some time due to injury. Yes, he hasn't really stuck around with one franchise for a really long time. Um, and it did look like after Seattle going into Tennessee that things were going to continue maybe trending downwards. But he goes to Cleveland and pops off, right? He has a really, a really solid, I guess, tenure with the Cleveland Browns. Ends up with the Baltimore Ravens this past season. And again, was a solid pass rushing threat. I, I think really the big question here with, with Clowney, what's the financial asking price from his side? We know Joe Douglas and, and how he operates at this point. He has his price. He's going to stick to it. But... And funny enough, I actually wanted the Jets to pursue Clowney years and years ago. We never did it because of that exact reason. Clowney wanted too much money. But we lost Huff to free agency, which sucks, right? Obviously, I'm pumped for Huff. You know, he's getting a huge contract and a bigger role with Philly. But, you know, homegrown guy, undrafted free agent. I wish that we could have retained him. Now, we don't necessarily need an edge rusher like we do left tackle, like we do, you know, a veteran running back. Um... But it's interesting to think about Jadavian Clowney as a sub pass, like a, a, a pass rusher in a limited role with this style of defense. Will McDonald, JFM, Jermaine Johnson, Michael Clements, right? Fresh legs constantly. Guys with big time motors. Uh, now, Clowney, the motor has been questioned from time to time. But when you're surrounded with a lot of talented younger players like this, it could be interesting, right? I, I mean, and also too, Quinnen and Kinlaw lining up on the inside. I mean, man, talk about third and long, third and long situations, third and 12. Kinlaw, Quinnen, Jermaine, Woman. I mean, throw whoever you want out there. We have so many pass rushers, in excess of pass rushers, and Clowney would just add to that. Um, but of course, you know, again, we have to be smart with the money here. And, uh, you know, ask the question, okay, well, how much is he asking for? He's coming off a good season. He's not going to be asking for the same amount that he got going into 2023, uh, clearly. So we'll see what happens. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. Thanks so much for watching. And as always, go Jets.